today we got some breaking news we just had to come out with. You know, there's all these crazy things that come out on the internet. We're gonna be talking about Indian today, so stay tuned and see what the heck we found out, the truth that's gonna be going on out there. Where do you hear this news? You know, there's a couple videos going out right now that's talking about Indian gonna start selling bikes on the internet. We're gonna talk about a little bit of this stuff today, so stay tuned and listen to everything that's going on, and we'll even tell you everything at the end. We're even gonna talk a little bit about Harley Davidson, what's going on with them, but they're basically saying that both of these two companies are gonna start selling bikes on the internet, and they're gonna bypass their dealerships. Right now, that's not what's really going on. So we're gonna to explain today what the real truth is. We got a hold of Indian today, the corporate office, and got some information from them. We actually heard what the CEO is gonna be sending out to all their dealers, and they may be even going public with it. But basically says that it's, it's totally a lie. They're not selling any new bikes on the, on the internet. You can't buy them on a website. You know, you can go and look at things just like any dealership, like the dealership that we're in right now. You can stop by, or you might be able to check out their website. They may have, you know, some bikes their on bikes there online. that you can see. You might be able to see their prices and things like that, but you still have to come into the store to buy it. Same thing with Harley Davidson. They're not selling any new bikes on the internet. That is not happening. Neither one, Indian Motorcycles or Harley Davidson is not selling new bikes on the internet. No. So you can't go, can't go on a website, pick up your bike and have it delivered to you and skip the dealership. That's, That's right. not happening. And there might be. You know, I'm going to try to put down here, flash over here maybe while I'm talking now, with, which I Googled it. I Googled it too, just a Harley Davidson. Well, there is a Harley Davidson dealer that you can buy a bike. Well, you can go online, you can fill out your credit report, get your credit approved, you can pick the bike out, but you, you know, and you can have that bike delivered to your house. But once again, it's the dealership that sold you the bike. They're the ones that's gonna deliver the bike. It's not corporate. It's not HarleyDavidson.com. <laughs> that's right. And it's not gonna be Indian.com that's gonna be selling any of these bikes. They are not going to go away from their dealerships. In either case, they all support, just like it's gonna come out from the Indian CEO, they support their dealerships 150%. You hear this crazy stuff on the internet when somebody's telling you, hey, this is what they're doing, this is what I heard, I heard this from the CEO. First of all, you didn't hear it from the CEO because you're gonna see the letter coming out real soon here in the next day or two. You're gonna see the letter the CEO sends out and he's telling you he didn't say that and he's not going down that road. So once again, you always have to look at the sources that people are coming up with this stuff. You know, sometimes people are just looking to try to make a name for themselves, trying to get out, you know, whatever they can come up with. You know, I don't know who told this person, or these people about this on, on YouTube and put these videos out saying that this is what they're doing, but whoever their sources are, they didn't give them the actual truth of what's going on. They are incorrect, they're false statements. So always double check your sources. Uh, Call your local dealership, ask them, see what they say. If you hear some news and you're like, oh my gosh, I can't believe they're doing that. I'm not gonna do that any more business with them. So always check your sources, double check, never hurts because there's a lot of stuff out there on the internet and you wanna make sure you get all the right facts. And if you're looking for information and you can't find it, and you hear something like there's a rumor like that, give us a call. Come down here and put a comment or you can find our email, we'll flash it across the bottom. You can always contact us and say, hey, I heard Indian, I heard Harley Davidson, I heard BMW is doing this. And we'll do our sources that we have and we'll, we'll try to, our sources we'll get you the facts and the truth of what's really going on. That's what we're all about. Giving you great information, giving you the truth, giving you all the facts, and we'll leave it at that. There you go. Thanks for hanging out with us today. I hope you got some great information out of this. Uh, subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Share us with your family and friends. Think about Patreon. Give us a big thumbs up. Ring that bell for notifications, and we'll see you on the next video. All right. And Indian's not going out of business. They're not suffering. It's like all the other motorcycle dealers. Everybody is, is down in sales yeah. this year. You know, they finally got their inventories back up, just like the dealership for now. They got a full inventory of bikes sitting in here, and it's going to take a while. Interest is real high. So, yes, everybody is not doing as well as what we should be doing. But the, the, nobody's going out of business. Indian's not closing up. Harley Davidson's not going out of business. And we're going to talk about that in another video. We've got the answer of how Harley Davidson, hey, maybe even Indian can do the same thing that we're going to recommend that they could turn the sales completely around. There you go. So stay tuned for an upcoming video on that. See you guys later. Bye.